Former University of Zambia UNSA workers have joined the outcry against unpaid retirement benefits in the country. There has been a group of retirees frequenting the Ministry of Justice, some who retired as far back as 1992 soliciting for their money, but to no avail. On the morning of 20th October 2020, a group of UNSA retirees, among whom are former lecturers and other workers from various departments, gathered at the University of Zambia Graduation Square. Secretary General for the UNSA Retirees Executive Committee, Stanislas Mukuka, explains that the total number of the retirees is over 500, and that Minister of Finance, Walyangandu, in November 2019, informed them that the ministry had acquired a loan from the Zambia National Commercial Bank, Zanako, of 200 million kwacha to pay them off. He says, however, to date, Nothing has come out of it, and there has been no communication. They have wondered why the current government is showing reluctance in paying them their money, saying they retired in 2012 and have been advocating for their money for eight years. They say they should be treated with respect, as they have contributed to the development of the country. Some have vowed not to support the Patriotic Front government come 2021 general elections, saying they are tired of struggling financially, due to unpaid benefits. The, we, have, we have been engaging the management with the meeting, meeting after meeting, but the outcome is that they haven't been given, just imagine six months to date, they haven't resolved the issue of, 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 of one clause which, which the bank has come up with. This is not our part to, to come into details of knowing how, how far they have gone. Our interest is to get our money, you see? It's like a parent in a home. The, the, the child should not know where the father is getting all the money, getting the money. We are supposed to just say, oh, in the Ramazan Zabuela, get your money. We have been engaging them and we have now gone into details to know what, what, what the, the, the problem. The problem is just a, a simple clause where the Zanako is demanding that uh, they should have the, the security bond, security, to be tied to the, to the, to, to, to the money. So that uh, I don't know why they are scared. <laughs> Ngataba unfuro kwa watu juu ya chama moneke kuadi. One day baka tu tambo bamba mlemu ni murodi. Ndere nde fishinga. Tuka fula. Because of tabale fwaya. Tabale fwaya kwa watu tu tu lande na mchishi. No tabale fwaya. Imbi ya shesu ni vile tu watu tredi tayi. Aba na besu wale chula. Aba na baba wale watu mokuya mukusa mbiza kumangalande. Aba na besu wale pula mafumo mla ndoa kwa watu tatu kwa tembi ya shaku watu mokuya kusukuru. Na meka la tabale fwaya kutu lande. Because the head of state. So if we to lady our president, we are praying to the president to say if he doesn't know what is taking place at Unza, and that now the president should know that Unza are trying to deliberately Unza retirees. They want to squash the money, the ways uh, Simukanga and their friends in 2010 squashed the money. So we want you, President, Mr. Dr. Chakwalung, to assist Unza retirees right up now. The retirees say various letters written to President Edgar Lungu and Minister of Higher Education Brian Mushimba months ago to help them get their money have not been responded to. Meanwhile, Minister of Finance Walyangandu did not pick up calls made by Movie TV News by broadcast time. Zipora Mushala, Movie TV News, Lusaka.